A lot of Olympians making their way home today. Next up for the Summer Games, Paris in three years. The handoff officially happened during the closing ceremony in Tokyo, the end of an Olympics that was unlike any before. A celebration of what we as humans are capable of when we come together. It is the one event that brings people together from all over the world. And at a time, the world needed it more than ever. I know we all went through tough times. I think a lot of people need this. This is one time for our country to come together, unite, and just cheer for everyone. I think it's more meaningful. To get there, Olympians faced challenges they'd never experienced before. All the gyms were closed. So we would throw in his driveway out into the bean field. Training out of their garages for a little while. And working out with my mom. Just making it to Tokyo was a win. Put in all this work, so let's just see what you can do. We are at the Olympics right now. It's a huge honor. It's unmatchable. And a whole new journey for me. Being called an Olympian is an honor. You're really on the world stage. The culmination of everything that you've worked for, about to go off in 48 seconds. Let's do it. They gave us so much, moments to celebrate from the start. So it's overwhelming in the best kind of way. I told somebody I didn't even know how I felt. I didn't even, I couldn't remember if it was day or night. <laughs> what a night to see you guys go one, two to kick off USA Swimming. Uh, it was incredible. Can you show me that medal? It's beautiful. Yes, so beautiful. What was the moment like when you're on the podium? Well, I was crying, but no one could see because we had to wear those huge masks on our face. Put it on the bar and I'll give it my best shot. It means the world to get to represent the people that have raised you up, been there to support you. It is beyond a dream come true. Gold, first time in women's canoe. for a Georgia natives lead off and anchor that race. I feel like my heart was about to yes, pop out of my chest. An Olympics with more first. Never before has a swimmer who competed for a Division Three team made it all the way to the Olympics. Andrew Wilson is the first. Such a, a crazy moment, it's, it's hard to even put into words. Increases awareness of the sport and increases excitement about the sport. <laughs> we just ran into each other. High school classmates and friends together in Tokyo. What an incredible experience, what a great fit. After this summer, I'm going to be done and my swimming career is over. You've already made that decision. Yeah. Every athlete has a story of strength and perseverance, but some are hard to even comprehend. I had about eight months I was laying in a hospital bed where I could not move. All I could do was blink. They did not know what would happen when they pulled it out. It was so close to his heart. It was never an excuse. It was only like motivation. And those stories of overcoming made their Olympic moment mean all the more. party everybody we felt the connection right along with their loved ones as we experienced all the emotions of the summer games together come on Kenny with friends at the businesses where they work to the living rooms where they grew up Thank you to the Olympians and their families. There are just no words and how proud we are. And to Japan for bringing us together. So many emotional moments watching the Olympics. And Cheryl, you had the great opportunity to be with so many of these families at their watch parties. Mm. Two weeks, yeah. you slaved <laughs> over the editor, oh, editing machine over here. Listen, she, she should get the gold medal because oh, Cheryl, geez put together countless pieces. I would say You're over so 60 pieces. You're you so should sweet. get the gold medal for all of your hard work. But Listen, just being with those yeah. families and, and really bringing us these great stories from the front lines. The honor is all mine. I, I can't think of a, a more special time to be invited into someone's home and to share that moment with them when they have seen their kids pursue this dream their whole lives really is an honor. And I want to just thank everyone who let us into their living rooms and thank you all for being a part of it. It felt like a couple of weeks that we all really needed. Yeah, you think you could do two more weeks of Olympics? Let's do it. <laughs> Paralympics. We'll have some great Paralympic <laughs> stories for you too. Winter Olympics oh, in yeah, six it just months. just keeps going. It never stops. <laughs> we'll, be, we'll be right back. <laughs>